Hello ladies, it's your girl Stylish Stylist back with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you all how I color this 613 Blonde Virgin Hair Wig um, into Teal Thrill, which is also available on my website for purchase at thestylishstylist.net slash shop. But anyway, the color that I'm using today is Jade by Adore and... All I have to say, y'all, is this is about to be so awesome. You want a pair of gloves. You don't want to stain your nails or your fingers. Just put gloves on, you know. And we're going to be doing the watercolor method. So, uh, I just warmed up a little water. I don't like the water where I live. So, uh, yeah, I had to boil it a little bit. Warmed it up, poured it in there. It doesn't have to be too hot. Just, you know, kind of warm. Also, I just went back and listened, y'all, and I hear those sirens. Like, I live by a fire station, so just excuse it if you hear it in any of my videos. I know it sounds like a mixtape, but <laughs> we gonna get through it. <laughs> so, I always just start off by putting a little bit in there. I don't start out putting a whole uh, bottle because as you dip the wig... It's going to soak that color in in different parts and you don't want it to all be in just one part or certain parts of your wig. You want the whole wig colored. So I add the color as I go so that I can do, um, you know, each part piece by piece and make sure everything gets that color in. So now to the fun part, we're going to start coloring the wig. So like I said earlier, we're just going to start dipping in. I always start at the bottom. And you want to just keep dipping. As you dip, you're going to see the color difference, you know, how it goes from blonde to this teal color. And you just keep dipping until you get your desired color but like I said you want to make sure that every piece gets that color in there so don't just try to um just sit it in here for a second and come back and take it out no check your wig dip it and as you as the color soaks in you're gonna see the water get like clearer like it's doing watercolor is always still gonna be the color of the hair dye but as it like I said as it soaks in you're gonna see what I mean by the water is gonna get clear and that's when you start adding your um just adding some more color in there now as y'all can see the color is finally changing it's starting to get saturated now so like I said, just keep on dipping it, dipping it, dipping it. <laughs> when I dip, you dip, we dip. But for real though, keep dipping it. Uh, kind of run your fingers through it. Like I said, you want to make sure every piece of the hair is dyed.
So right here, y'all can kind of see what I mean when I was saying earlier that your water's gonna like start turning clear or whatever. And now see, look. Look at how it just changed as soon as I put that color in there. Yeah, so like I said, we do not want no half color wigs out here, ladies. Saturate, saturate, saturate. Now is the time you add some more color and you keep on dipping, keep on dipping. Like I said, go from top to bottom. I mean bottom to top, excuse me. here um i just want to say be careful when you're dyeing the lace this is a lace prono by the way i don't believe i said that at the beginning of the video but be careful because you don't want to tear your lace um and you also want every part of that wig to be colored um you know to me it's just more blonde or something at the top i don't know but just make sure that you get that part good, run your fingers through it, but don't tug on it too hard because like I said, you don't want to tear your lace. so this is the last of the color i only used one bottle i would say i could have used like another half bottle or something but i don't know i got the color that i liked so it was cool and like i told y'all earlier as you put the hair in there everything is gonna soak up so now that all of the bottom part of the wig, wig is soaked and I'm on like the last part of my color, I'm just gonna mix it in and I'm only gonna dip the front part now because that's the part that needs some more color. So yeah, just add the color, stir it in and we finna finish the rest of this dyeing.
So now I feel like uh, I have the color that I just about want. So we're about to take this wig out. And, uh, yeah, baby. I'm sorry, y'all. This is my baby. But this is the desired look. I hate I didn't get to show y'all how I did the installation. But I might do that on another, another video. Sorry. Thanks for tuning in. And I love you all. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, ladies.